Hey guys, welcome back to the Conservative Patriot. My name is Keith. Hope you're doing well. So I haven't put a video out since Election Day, and I really haven't paid attention to the news since Election Day. I turned it on here and there, um, but I've really been kind of, I don't know, not really in a funk, but just uh, in a what the fuck is going on situation here. Um, if you have at all watched the news or looked at any of the reports about uh, fraudulent votes all over the country, especially in these battleground states where people who are 170 years old and 120 years old are, are voting uh, and or registering to vote is is pretty amazing to me because I didn't know they could still do that at 170 years old. It's I mean, when I'm 170, I hope I can still vote and, and register to vote, too, because good Lord knows we all need it. Obviously, Joe Biden needs it more than everybody because they're still finding votes. And um, what I really don't like is the fact that the Democrats, and I shouldn't be surprised by this, complete hypocrisy on their side, they're, they're saying, oh, well, you know, you guys need to just suck it up. Like we did. I'm like, I don't remember you guys just sucking it up. There was a lot of crying and vagina hats going on. Um, but I can tell you one thing. I haven't seen one fucking riot since Joe Biden was announced as the uh, winner. Although the those states had boarded up their stores and were all prepared for a riot to happen after the election. That should tell you something. They know who the riot was coming from. They were coming from their own side. Democrats are going to riot. And I tell you what, I, I've seen reports about Arizona counting votes. They're not done yet, by the way. And neither is Georgia, and neither is Pennsylvania. Um, but the media and uh, the, well, you know, the media. It's not the states. The states haven't called anything yet. It's the media that's like, oh, look, Joe Biden won. No, they're not done counting. And in Arizona... I just saw a report this morning that Biden and Trump are like 0.02% away from each other and the votes aren't done. And they said it looks like it's going it's going in Trump's direction. So imagine that. Biden's going to lose Arizona. Take that off your total score, Sleepy Joe, and then knock off Georgia when that goes towards Trump. And then you don't have 270 anymore, do you? So... This is far from over, I believe. Um, but I can tell you what, if it is going to take, you know, 36, 37 days like it did when um, Gore and Bush were going at it, so be it. Let the process work. But right now, it's not working. This is not how an election is won or lost. If Joe Biden wins fair and square, so be it. That's how, that's, that's how it works. He won. Do I like it? No. This is not winning fair and square. This is complete fraud. And it's right in front of everybody. And for the entire country not to be up in arms is surprising to me. No, maybe not. It's not that surprising. Because the Democrats are full of cheaters and liars. And it's it's being shown right now. If I was on the winning side and knew that there was fraud going on, I would not be happy. I would not be happy at all, because that's not where our country is built on. This is how socialist countries elect presidents or don't elect presidents. Look at Venezuela. I don't even know what's going on down there still. One guy won legitimately, but the other guy won't leave. So that you know that should tell you where our country is heading. Uh, if Biden and Harris actually step into the White House, but I'm telling you right now, this is far from over. Uh, it's going to the courts and it will be decided there. So I don't know what to do, man. I, I, I even considered canceling this YouTube channel because I was just like, you know what, what's the, what's the point since election day, I have lost nearly 20 subscribers, 20 subscribers since election day. What the fuck? You can't just tell me that 20 people are like, yeah, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out of here. It's absurd. So there's clearly a lot 
of suppression going on right now with any social network. This one being YouTube, because that's where I put my videos. But anyways, if you guys have any information on states where you live, that'd be great to, to see and read. Um, but, you know, I'm trying to keep the faith. I'm trying to hope for a, a different outcome. Or I'm trying to f uh, hope for an outcome that is legitimate. Because right now it's not. So I guess we'll see what happens in the next uh, couple of weeks. few weeks, actually. But look for another video coming soon. And always remember to stay on the right side. Have a great day. Like, share, and subscribe. Talk to you soon.